Here's meteorologist James Gilbert. We've got an overcast morning for you. Uh, could see a couple sprinkles over the next few hours, but the main, the bulk of the storm system is still off to our southwest. You can see the rain's just starting to peek into New York State. Uh, just past Erie, Pennsylvania here, and uh, it's not very organized, right? So you can see some heavier rain, rain uh, well south of Cleveland. A lot of that going to push into a northern Pennsylvania, southern tier area. Generally, I think uh, I'm not expecting any washout of a day, albeit you have the couple factors going on that raise our flood concern. Not going to be a lot of rain, but you've got snow melt because temperatures are so warm. You get some wind in there as well, as well as we've already had a lot of rain and snow melt. So that on top of the half inch that we could see this afternoon, we've got an aerial flood watch. That means a lot of the creeks, a lot of the streams going to continue to rise over the next 24 hours with that rain. So certainly watch out if you live in any low, low lying areas, watch those sump pumps certainly and uh, flooded roadways. That's the number one concern, right? Some of those uh, low uh, dips in the roadways could uh, certainly build up on some water. We'll avoid those today. Future cast here. We're dry for the morning commute. Rain moves in by lunchtime and then moves out by dinner time. So it's probably a wet commute. Windshield wipers moving later in the day and we hold on to the warmth. We know we've got a big blast of cold coming. But a lot of times with these storm systems, it just takes a little bit longer than you think. So I bet it takes until really Wednesday midday. Even by Wednesday morning, we're still not that bad, still pretty comfortable. But I bet by lunchtime, 1, 2 o'clock, that's when we turn into the 20s. That's when the wind starts to ramp up. And we'll even get some, I think, lake effect snow showers late Wednesday and into Thursday. That's not the main snow that I'll be talking about, though, in about 30 seconds. Right now, 32 degrees. We warm up into the 50s this afternoon. Uh, otherwise, besides the rain, it is very comfortable when it comes to temperatures. Enjoy it because we dropped those numbers significantly. Look at the wind chill here. Uh, low 30s tomorrow morning, single digits as we get into Thursday. All right, so there's a winter storm on its way. Friday starts early in the day, lasts through the day, and I'm expecting likely over six inches of snow. It's probably a longer duration event, so it may take a long time to get all that snow, but it will certainly come. Uh, it could wipe that snow deficit that we have again uh, for the day on Friday and into Saturday. Mark Alley. All right, James, watching it closely.